you've just tuned in to Gaming World 003 2009. Hey John, should I do it like you've just tuned in to get Ah, forget it, let me just start. Hey, how you guys doing? Today I'm going to show you how to do something kind of cool, kind of awesome, kind of great that can help you. I'm going to show you how to play DVDs using your Windows Media Player. I would advise you to update to version 11. I'm going to show you how to enable the DVD feature. Alright? Now follow my steps. Follow my steps very closely. You're going to go to start. Run. Remember, it's start, run. It's not start, search. It's start, run, not search. It's not sh search. Okay? You're going to type reg edit. Reg edit. R E G E D I T. Don't type reg phenom. Type reg edit. Okay? And hit okay. Now I'm going to go pretty slowly with these steps. No, I'm going to go extremely fast. No, I'm just kidding. So you're going to go to... Wait, let me just make it look like yours. Yours is going to look like this. You're going to go to H key, current user. You're going to make that bigger by clicking that plus. Then it's going to turn to a minus. But don't be scared. Don't be alarmed. Nothing's not going to happen. Just you're going to see a drop down menu. Now once you see this menu, you're gonna go to software okay now once you see software you're gonna open up uh, Microsoft open that up by clicking the plus next to it and it'll turn to a minus or a dash but I would prefer minus scroll down scroll down okay where is it at give me a second Oh, sorry about that. Go to media player. Open that up. Now scroll down. Go to player. Open that up. And click on settings. So you're going to right click. Go to new. Shrink value. Not key. Shrink value, okay? Now you're going to type this. Enable DVD. UI, you know, type it exactly as I typed it. This is the I'll put the name in the video description so you guys don't mess it up. And now you're gonna have to double click on it, and now you're gonna type yes. Don't type no, type yes, and click OK. Don't click cancel, click OK. All right, now once you insert a DVD, you'll be able to. So I'll play it using the Windows Media Player. And please don't be scared. And also, uh, if you did anything wrong, you might have just, uh, you know, destroyed your computer. So, uh, but don't worry, your computer won't get destroyed unless if it gets destroyed. No, I'm just kidding. Thank you for watching this video. Hopefully, I helped some of you guys out there. Please subscribe, please rate, please comment. Enjoy yourself.